Hey everybody, welcome back to TPG's World. It is me, TPG. It is the 4th of November, 2021. And I'm here to do a vlog. It's around 8.30 at night. So I got a lot to talk about in this vlog. I got some mail to open up. I got some packages in the mail for my birthday, which is coming up in only two days. And I'm going to talk about that and um, my trip and all that good stuff. So let's get started. So first of all, Halloween weekend was fun, but I went to one party on Friday night, the Harry Potter themed party. I think I mentioned that in one of my videos. And um, I got very sick. I didn't wear a jacket and I got very, very, very sick. Um, I got a cold, a bad cold. So when I went to the party on on Saturday, the one I always go to every year, the big one that I always dress up really cool. I, uh, the theme was Alice in Wonderland. I dressed as the White Rabbit. My leg as you know, it has been hurting severely bad. My knee has been killing me. I could barely walk on it Saturday, um, and I also was so sick. I didn't get to stay at the party very long. We only stayed about maybe two hours, and I had to leave, which is very unrare. People were still there. The party was in full swing. I was just so miserably sick, and I hurt so bad, and there wasn't a lot of places for me to sit, so I had to come home. Sunday, I could barely walk on my legs, so I ended up going to see a doctor on um, Monday, and I found out that I had, the doctor said that I had ruptured a major muscle in my leg. Um, I've never heard of rupturing a muscle. I think he meant tearing a muscle. He used the word ruptured, but he said tore. So he thinks that that happened. He said basically those kind of things heal themselves um, and just give it time. He gave me a cortisone pack. I keep saying chromosome, but it's cortisone pack to take. Um, I've been taking and I started it today. Um, I felt actually pretty decent today, um, but not up to par totally but I've been doing okay so we'll see how that goes um, but yeah that's pretty crazy um, so that's what happened with my legs so at least I found something they sent me Tuesday or Wednesday um, to get an MRI done. not an MRI I'm sorry guys I always get these two things mixed up an ultrasound done to see if I had any blood clots that was yesterday or Wednesday that was today so I said it was yesterday yesterday and uh, there was no blood clots found so I'm good with that so luckily that's safe I'm good on that so basically I just gotta wait on it to heal itself but like I said today's been the best day on my leg but I'm still having some soreness but we'll see how it goes um, the rest of the weekend as far as my trip goes um, I was supposed to go with a friend of mine from work um, her dad, they think he had an angina attack, um, so he's very sick. He's in his 80s, so we may not get to go on the trip um, because she's got to see how her dad does. Um, so we probably, we may not get to go on the trip. So my birthday um, will probably just be me sitting home. I'll probably do a live stream with you guys. It, it depends. Now, I want you guys to keep him in your prayers and pray for him and also pray that we can go on my trip because ever since my mom died, I haven't done a lot for my birthday and it's been really bad. Um, so it's because um, uh, my mom always made it really special. She always bought me gifts and always had my favorite carrot cake and always cook me dinner and, and always had things so I don't get a lot of you know like I used to get gifts from my family and stuff so I got some gifts in the mail and I love it when people send me gifts in the mail for my birthday it, it makes my day and of course the kids always celebrate and like tomorrow they're throwing me a party and those are wonderful and I love it I love it so much and um, I can't wait I save all the cards they make me and they give me gifts and they'll have we're gonna have ice cream though because we had like three birthdays this week in the school we kids have had a lot of cupcakes and we've had too much sugar and too much of a mess so I think we're gonna do ice cream for mine which is a little easier, I think, for me to handle than that. Um, but, uh, so yeah, but um, I just was really excited about this trip, and so I'm praying it can still happen, but it doesn't look doubt. It looks kind of doubtful. And it would have been the first thing I did for my birthday in years because, like I said, I just, since Mom died, I haven't done a lot. Um, I think it's kind of a, a depressing day for me. But um, I do have some people that always remember my birthday, and I want to thank them and open these gifts that they sent me here in a minute. But that's kind of where I'm at um, with my weekend, my trip, and all that stuff. So hopefully I'll pray for my friend's dad because I really do want him to be better. Um, I know how scary that can be when you have an older parent. I know all the scares I went through with my dad being in and out of the hospital and stuff like that. And I pray that I can go on this trip. And I don't want to sound greedy. And I'm not greedy at all. You know, I understand if I can't go. And maybe I can find something else to do. Or maybe I'll just stay home and enjoy my weekend off. Who knows? We'll find something find something else to do, rent a movie or watch TV or who knows, I'll find something else to do if, if I have to. 
But anyway, with that being said, I want to go ahead and open these wonderful presents that I got for my birthday. I was going to wait and do this on my birthday, but I decided to go ahead and do it now. So, um, because I'm excited and I can't hold it any longer. I love it. I love it. Um, so let's open up these first gifts. Okay. So these first ones are from Carol. Carol, Carol Caps got me some gifts here. They're right here. They came up, see, about a week ago, and I told her I was going to wait till close to my birthday, so they've been sitting on my table, and they've just been, like, really, like, tempting me, and I know Carol's not told me what they are yet, and I was like, oh, my goodness gravy, so I'm trying to cut them open here. I need to keep a knife in here, but I don't, I'm always afraid I'll cut my fingers off. What is it, Carol? What is it, Carol? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Carol got me some Oscar de la Rente cologne. Carol, that smells good. I love Oscar de la Rente. Mm, mm, mm. Carol, yeah. Oscar de la Rente cologne. Look at that, guys. Oscar de la... Carol, that is wonderful. She's always so thoughtful. I love her. She always remembers my birthday. She always remembers Waffles' birthday. And this is her second one that was sent to me by her. She, Carol, you have to get me two, honey. Thank you so much for everything. I'm so excited. Oh my God, Carol, what'd you do? Last year she got me those amazing shoes that I still wear this day. What's this? What is this, Carol? What is this? I'm wrapped in this. Let's see what it is. What is this? Oh, it's bubble wrap, Carol. You know what bubble wrap does to me. You know what bubble wrap does to me, Carol. What is this? It's wrapped up. There's a card in here. Let's see. Let's see what this is. I'm going to open up and out. It's these little packages right here. So let's see what they are. Oh gosh, this bubble wrap. Carol, this is like my best friend. I love bubble wrap. I have one of them little pop it things. It's just a pop. Those sounds like bubble wrap. Oh, I love those things. Have y'all ever seen those? Like, I have them at school. I have them on my desk. Oh, it's body wash. It's Oscar de la Rente body wash and hair gel. Is that hair gel? Body wash and gel. Do. Oh, okay. I thought it said hair gel. I was like, body wash and hair gel? That's kind of cool. That <laughs> would be like the ultimate. Oh, it's another. Oh, so it's hair and body wash. It's two things. Thank you, Carol. Oscar de la Rente cologne and Oscar de la Rente hair and body lotion. So this is the cologne here. Oscar de la Rente. And this is the body wash. Thank you, Carol. I love it. Oh my gosh. I'm going to use that tomorrow. When I get ready to go to the shower, and definitely, definitely, if my trip does come true, I will um, you open that and use that on my trip, so I smell good. The next one is came from Amazon Prime. Let's see, who this is. This arrived today. I got this today. At the post office box. Let's see. There is a card in the bottom. Let's see. Um, let's see. Is there? Happy birthday, love you bunches from Nicole. Oh, this is from Nicole Paints Her Face, my really good friend. I love her so much. Nicole Paints Her Face. She always remembers me on my birthday and at Christmas and all that kind of stuff. So let's see what this is. Hmm, what is it? <laughs> let's see what it is. Oh, let me cut the box open. I don't want to cut it. I don't remember want to cut it. Oh my goodness, it's one of my favorite things in the world. It's Billy Idol, the Funko Pop. Thank you, Nicole. That is so cool. I love Billy Idol. I was just going to be reading his book, listening to his book on audio. I love Billy Idol. He's actually one of the people I style my hair like a lot. I love Billy Idol. Thank you so much, Nicole. That is so cool. I love Billy Idol. And that's Bill, the Billy Idol Funko Pop on the back. And there's the side view of it. Oh my gosh, I love Funkos. This has been a while since I've collected Funkos, too, so I'm really glad. And I haven't showed you guys some of my latest collection. Thank you, Nicole, and thank you, Carol, for the wonderful gifts. I love them so much. I'm going to put these in my collection, and I'm going to, um, oh, my gosh, thank you so much, guys. I so appreciate it, Carol. Thank you, Carol, for the wonderful, wonderful body wash and the cologne. You know, I love my cologne. And thank you so much, Nicole, for the Billy Idol Funko Pop. I always thought he was so cute when he was younger. And I always wanted to style my hair like him, so that's why I started like dyeing my hair blonde and styling my hair. Every time I style my hair, I think of myself as Billy Idol. I actually did him for Halloween last year. At that party, I was Billy Idol. So uh, I'm so excited about that. Thank you so much, guys. I love love it so much. You guys rock. Thank you, too, for always remembering my birthday. Um, it's very special. Um, I'm so excited to have gotten some birthday presents. Um, 
You guys rock, and thank you so much for all the love and support throughout the years. Um, I will talk to you guys soon, and I appreciate everything that you guys do. I appreciate all the love you guys give me. Um, if I don't go out of town, I might do a live stream and sit here and spend some of my birthday with you guys. If I do go out of town, I, I'll probably do a video throughout the day, like filming different things, or I might live stream from downtown Charleston. I'm not sure what I'm going to do yet, um, but do pray for my friend's husband and pray, I'm not my friend's husband, my friend's dad, and pray that we might can get to go on our trip, but if not, you know, pray that maybe I'll figure out something else to do. Um, if you want to get some of my merchandise, check it out below. Um, if you want to, okay, you want to send me something for my birthday, feel free to do so. You don't have to. If you want to send a card, I love cards. Feel free to do so at my post office box um, and all that good stuff. I love that. Or you can send it to my PayPal, whatever you want to do. I love you so much, guys. And you're the bomb. Bye.